on the afternoon of August 14 in Hanoi, Prime Minister Phạm Minh Chính chaired the National Online Conference to review 10 years of implementing Directive No. 40 of the Party Central Committee Secretariat on straining the party's leadership over social policy credit. As of July 31st, the total source of social policy credit nationwide reached over 373,000 billion Vietnamese dome, an increase of over 238,300 billion dome, 2.8 times higher, when Directive No. 40 was first implemented. The average annual growth rate reached nearly 11%. Over the past 10 years, social policy credit capital has helped more than 21 million poor households and other policy beneficiaries to borrow capital, with loan turnover reaching over 733,150 billion dome, debt collection turnover reaching nearly 510,350 billion dome, creating revolving loan capital reaching nearly 70% of loan turnover. Prime Minister Phạm Minh Chin appreciated the systematic and scientific implementation of the Social Policy Bank and the results achieved after 10 years of implementing Directive 40. Social policy credit has become a price spot, meeting the people's aspirations. At once, he directed many contents that need to continue to be implemented to contribute to effectively implementing the goal of rapid and sustainable poverty reduction, building new rural areas, ensuring social security, political stability, national defense and security, taking care of vulnerable groups, leaving no one behind, narrowing the gap between the rich and poor between regions and areas across the country.